Tomas, they, uh, they seem to make it really difficult for you guys, to yeah. meet, uh, particularly the offense. Mm -hmm. what, what was that? How would you characterize that? Um, I feel like defensively, we did a great job. We held them to 100 points, you know. A team like that who got hot at the beginning, um, we, we did our job just on the offensive end, you know. Um, we couldn't get it going, you know. A lot of us missed easy shots that we're used to making. You know, we had a lot of open threes, even though we made uh, we made just just as many as they did, you know. But um, you can't win with thirty four percent, you know. Um, we just got to make shots. You guys got to within one there mm -hmm. in the third quarter, and then seemed to slide a little bit yeah. like that. What, what, what happened? Um, we came out uh, aggressive in the third quarter, getting stops, you know, um, and then making making some baskets. But then at the end of the day, you know, if 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 we don't score, we can't we can't go in. How difficult is it as well? I mean, we saw you know game one after the trade. Yeah. Um. Yeah. You know, uh, they came out aggressive. Uh, losing ten in a row is a lot. Plus, getting uh, two new pieces. One of them was going off early. So, um, I think two things happened. Uh, we can't start the game like that. You know, being down fifteen or whatever it was. Um, even though we we came back in and then um. We just didn't hit shots today. You know, it was one of those days, and we would hit shots. It would have been a whole different game. Go ahead, Avery. All right, we'll go ahead and start with James first on Zoom. Go ahead. Hey, Domas. Uh, how difficult is this to try to piece this together on the fly? It seems like tonight specifically you had some continuity issues with just all of the new pieces, but where are you at with that, and how close are you getting – to where you're getting, uh, you're sort of comfortable with some of these new pieces. Um, I'm just trying to figure out the balance right now. Um, the guys on the bench are like, "Come on, be aggressive, shoot," you know. And I don't want to still step on anyone's toes, you know. I'm trying to, I'm trying to look to pass more than to score and be aggressive. Um, um, today I could have been way more aggressive. Drummond was off me, you know. I could have played my normal game, but um, I'm still trying to figure that out, you know. So um, the the more games, the better. Sean Cunningham. Yeah, Domas, you actually just touched on my question there. How how hard is it to kind of figure out that moment where you might have to be more selfish? Uh, well, today made it clear. <laughs> today made it clear, you know, um, I just got to be myself. I got to be myself out there. That's why they traded for me, you know, and I got to be aggressive out there. Antonio? Uh, on top of that, Simone's uh Alvin, you know, he definitely want to pick up the pace as far as, you know, the run game. Uh, and I know, you know, all these pieces just come together and you guys haven't really had any uh, practice time. But just want to know how that's going to work, you know, when you guys can get all on the same floor and understand how that how that run game, how you can pick up the pace of the game so you won't have starts like you did in the first, first quarter. Um, I think everyone's on the same page. No, um, all of us, uh, three that came, plus Dante, um, uh, uh, Trey and Josh, um, we all like to play fast, you know, um, we all like to play fast. It's just, we didn't make shots. I feel like we had a lot of open shots. Um, we just couldn't knock them down. Jason Anderson, go ahead. Hey, Domas, uh, what do you think was the difference tonight in terms of like the way the ball was moving? And, and I'm wondering if maybe part of, of the issue maybe you'll encounter is trying to run the system more than maybe just playing freely as you did in the first couple of games. Did you see some of that tonight? Um, I think we had, what do we have? 12 assists at the end, um, but that comes with missing shots. You know, we would have made the shots. Those, those uh, assists would have gone up. I felt like we did move the ball, maybe not as much as other games, you know, but um, it's tough when, when, there's no, when there's no rhythm, there's, there's no groove, you know. We shoot, we miss, got to run back on defense, you know. They're playing fast, so it just kind of got us out of our natural rhythm. Brandon, Brandon go ahead. Yeah, Domas, now that you've had a couple days around this group, what do you think of the uh, group of personalities that you have with this squad? Oh, they're great. They're all funny guys, good people. You know, um, it's going to be fun. You know, um, we're just going to figure out the thing on the court more and more. Um, like I said today, I feel like we did get open shots. You know, we just had to knock them down. All right, we'll take one more on Zoom. Go ahead, Chris. Hey, Domas, you guys had all this momentum with those two wins and, and the trades and all that excitement. Are you at all worried that this loss might have stymied some of that, stopped some of that momentum that y'all had? Uh, not at all. Not at all. Um, everyone's already thinking about next game. You know, we're going to watch this one off and uh, we want to finish this, this road trip right with a win.